Kamaru Usman is the reigning UFC welterweight champion and will be defending his title in a rematch against Colby Covington this Saturday in New York at UFC 268. But a fast-rising challenger entered the welterweight rankings this week. Kamzat Shamav is now number 10 after his dominant win over Li Jingliang just a week ago, but many think he will be closer to the title shot very soon. And champ Kamaru Usman was seriously impressed by the display of Chamath. First and foremost, he's done a tremendous job with the opposition he's been presented with. No shame in that. He's doing great. I like it. I love all the hype that's been there. Let's all be honest. Life isn't fair. So I know some guys get a faster push, some guys don't. It is what it is. More power to him. He's doing a phenomenal job with the position that he's been put in. Hats off to him, said the Nigerian Nightmare. A matchup between the two, however, does not seem very likely, as Usman hinted that he may retire sooner than later. I want to be that champion who does it all, he continued. I want to do it on my own time, like Khabib. I know a lot of people have been throwing a lot of shade, saying a lot of things about Khabib leaving when he wanted to leave. That's how you do it. Even George St. Pierre, that's how you do it. You leave when you want to. You don't let the sport retire you. So yeah, when I feel like that time's there, it's time for me to go. Triller Fight Club has announced a new and unique fight event that will take place at Globe Light Field on November 27th and will feature both professional MMA athletes and professional boxers. The new style of fighting will be called Triad Combat and will try to level the playing field between the boxers and MMA fighters. For now, three big names have been announced. Former UFC heavyweight Frank Mir, newly signed BKFC and fan favorite Mike Perry, and two-time boxing heavyweight title challenger Kubrat Pulev. Triller describes their product as a revolutionary new combat team sport which incorporates boxing and MMA rules in an aggressive, fast-paced manner with the fighters competing in a specially designed triangular ring over two-minute rounds featuring professional boxers competing against professional mixed martial arts fighters. The gloves will also be special and will be some kind of mix between MMA and boxing gloves. The event will also feature a true heavyweight musical support. Metallica will play a special concert. Justin Gaethje expects a certain title shot if he wins on Saturday. The former interim lightweight champ is fighting Michael Chandler in a high-stakes fight at UFC 268 and is looking at the winner of Charles Oliveira Dustin Poirier. And if the UFC has other plans, Justin is not going to take them kindly. Even if he, Chandler, wins, they probably won't give him a title shot. The only reason he got the first one was because it was perfect timing. But yeah, I already said it. If I don't get the shot, we riot. We go to war. I have to be biased when it comes to this. I'm not going to be around here for much longer. So if we're to get snubbed again, then yeah, I have to do something about it. Whether that's causing ruckus, I have to let my manager do his job. I got the best manager in the game. We all know what's supposed to happen if I get this win on Saturday night. So hopefully you all riot with me, declared Gaethje in the lead up to his UFC 268 fight with Chandler. Thanks all for checking out the Combat Crack Daily Updates on Combat Sports.